Hey, welcome to the Clay Station. And guess what? It's Halloween time. You know what that means. It's our time of the motherfucking year. So it's time to rock stages and burn shit down. That's what we're gonna do tonight. Watch. Check it out. We don't trick or treat. Pull up with the heat. Pull up with the heat. Okay, we should do uh, Southwest Strummer. That's the one. We just want to end up. We just want to end up. Thank you for your one, too. Pre-game rituals, always, you know, you know, there's some last minute changes you do to the set, and then there's the bang, and then we hit the stage, go do damage, but, uh, you know, pre-show rituals, that's, uh, it's important, man, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's almost religious. Yeah, this is Spider. I'm down with the DJ Clay Station, and I hope you down with it too. Boy, whoop, whoop, boy. my God, Spider right here. Yeah. These motherfuckers up there. He gets paid to beat motherfuckers up. Crush your ass. All right, so journey with me into the walls of a rock club. Let's, you know, let's get up here and look at all this. Let's see what type of cool shit we can find here. You know what they say, right? If you can't draw a crowd, draw a dick. So let's see who drew a dick on the wall. DJ Swan. Let me tell you a little story about that. Check out that sticker. See that sticker? See that? Let me tell you a little story about DJ Swan. Never met him. <laughs> fan. I'm a fan. Because when I was young, this a wee young little DJ. I was buying his breakbeat records. He used to have some cool shit like lock grooves. He did it as a loop. The needle wouldn't move. It would stay in that same groove. So it was a continuous loop. All this shit. He ended up becoming, or uh, for, uh, uh, short, uh, for some period of time at least, uh, Bex. Beck. Yep. Became Bex DJ. He called ICP to be their DJ. They said no. A couple years later, I got a phone call from ICP. And they picked me up as their DJ. It was real dope seeing his sticker there and knowing that DJ Swamp played that club. Everybody's played the Token Lounge though, but you know, story time. And it's a legit story, you know? And it, it, this was a uh, cool ass story for me to learn when I learned it myself. This in particular night, this was a live podcast uh, by Shaggy and the Creep, the podcast. It was a live one, a Halloween edition. Uh, you know, a small team of us put it together and rocked it. I'm King of the Cream. And you know what? You're watching the Clay Station. Yes, you are. You're tuned in. You're dialed in. Your eyes are now all bloodshot, too. Yes, it's so long. Showtime. It's time to go. It's time to test it up. And now things are getting serious. A lot of fun on the podcast. A lot of fun. You know, you guys are getting 
I'm giving you guys some more of that behind the scenes that you want. Oh my gosh. Hey, this is Tom Wood, and you're watching The Clay Station. Can I bring my brother Shaggy to the father's motherfucker? I said, can I bring Shaggy to the father's motherfucker? I'm gonna see. So I'm sure he's gonna be his life. Let's go, man. Come on, let me hear y'all. Motherfuckers, tweet, got a tweet, why you tweet? PlayStation. See y'all at least a weekend. Day one done. Success. Halloween time. I'm day two. Yo, it's DJ Clay. We're here again live on the Clay Station. And it's day two. It's Halloween weekend. Like I said, we run this bitch underground. We run this motherfucker this time of the year. It's our holiday. We run this bitch. We're in the green room right now at the Majestic Theater. I got my homies here chilling. I got more people showing up. Hey, the crowd is filling up downstairs right now as we speak. And uh, guess what? I'm about to hit the stage in a little while. Y'all gonna see that too. I'm gonna give you a little preview. Check this out. Come <laughs> on. 
at these moments right here before you hit the stage where you get that you get that little nerve you get nervous a little but at the same time you're just so fucking ready to do it and I'm ready it's day two What's up? You know who it is. It's the one and only big homie, Big Hoodoo. And you're watching the Clay Station. Oh, yeah. All right. Thank you so much. DJ Clay, Big Hoodoo, hitting the stage. We do the Ad Bro remix. Yo, he is psychopathic down for mad years. My motherfucking homie, your motherfucking homie. He's about to come out here and kill it like he always does, right, Clay? Y'all give it up one time! One motherfucking time for Big Modeling for uh, Levi next week. You guys can catch me at the Fashion Weekend. That's what you call a rap. <laughs> nah, that's a rap. You can call a uh, successfully executed. You know what it is. Ear drug music, Six. nigga. I'm official. Successfully executed is what you call it. That's a professional term, I believe. Now I'm about to go smoke and lay down with somebody's mama. Yep. <laughs> that feeling that you have when you get off stage after you just rock some shit. 
Best, best feeling in the world I'm, I'll never use today. Yo, I'm Jump Steady, and I want to tell y'all to check out the PlayStation, because that's what time it is. Go there right now, check that shit out. You know what time it is. Give it up for DJ Clay! Day three, Halloween. Halloween night, Detroit, sold out, Majestic Theater. Watch. Yeah. Yeah, shit gets crazy. Make sure you subscribe, hit that like button, drop some love in the comments. Y'all, Violent J here, the Duke of the Wicked, letting you know you're checking out the PlayStation. Two whoops for you. Whoop. Whoop.